So today we're going to talk about some of the new stuff that's going on in gardening. And, and the newest stuff that we're seeing that's coming about is the seed tape, right? So we bought, what we bought? Beets? We got beets, we got carrots. Beets and carrots. Stuff. So we went to Lowe's, I think it was, and they only had like two, two. things of seed tape. And so we come over here. We got the radish. Uh, they got spinach, uh, the classic mix with like salad mix, mm -hmm. and then lettuce. Like Even that spinach, because we haven't had much success at all with spinach. We might try some spinach again, but not the seed tape. It costs a little high. We need to understand how spinach grows and when to plant spinach before we spend that kind of money on uh, seed tape. Uh, you see, all the packs cost. I'm gonna put it right there. Three ninety seven. Yeah, three ninety seven. So. And they had this kind, of, like they had one too that they call it the starter garden. Yeah, I think that's just a uh, organic. It's just a mix of seeds, like a mixed seed pack. Oh. I think you'll do better just buying your one seeds. Yeah, one pack at a time. But this is their their organic uh, section. Kind of oh, that's that spineless okra? No, oh, what do you call that? A bush. It looks like a little bush okra. But it doesn't say bush on it, though. Does it? So, um, no, that's not bad. It's best pick a three nope. inches long. Nope, it doesn't really no. say bush. But uh, this kind of look like it, though. Like yeah. Another thing we wanted to show them as we come around. Uh, each, uh, uh, this is burpee side here. Was that, well that was all burpee over here. Yeah, but. And this is just regular, just vegetables. Whatever you're looking for, carrots, corn. I did see some uh, butternut squash that we wanted Which to get. One, uh, the carrot that we have planted, I don't see it over here. We got that from Rare Seeds. Oh. We can't get that from here. Yeah, it was a real sweet. It's like purple on the outside with that orange on the inside. Mm -hmm. It was real good. sweet. Uh, something else is new. It's called yeah. so, so Simple. simple. Yeah. And it's just like uh, pelletized uh, seeds that makes it easier to sow. But if you look at that, let me see if I can get that to focus in. It's only 10 seeds not worth four dollars mm -hmm. so that's 40 40 cents a seed plus tax uh like what paying five dollars yeah too much seed. too much and then they get this easy pods they call it the same thing like yeah it's like bigger seeds the easy pods are like bigger seeds but still 10 pods four dollars uh and something that we did see go down to that seed disc yeah that's gonna be something mm -hmm. that may be Worth to try? It might be worth trying. It's a total of a 12 inch disc and it has 50 seeds in each pack. And, and they don't just have just, uh, and that's more for container gardeners. Like if you got your container garden, it's circle, so it's like a disc. And show them that. They even got, they like even got a mix. herb mix. So for those people that are container gardens, you don't want to go and buy uh, different seeds and plant them. You basically buy the seed disc, and this has parsley, cilantro, and basil on it. And you can plant that. That should be nice. Mm -hmm. So we got a seed disc. Where's that seed tape? That's Look, get that seed disc. tape. This one with the colors on it. Okay. Check so, that out. Try it. Seed tape and seed disc. Mmm. That's going to look good. I like that seed tape. We, we planted ours. We haven't gotten anything to sprout up yet. So I don't want to, I don't want to like uh, give them a thumbs up on, on that seed tape just yet. But uh, hopefully in the next week or so, we start to get some sprouts. And that way we can kind of recommend some seed tape. Yeah. If that seed tape don't work, I'm not recommending Easy Pie, Seed This, Seed Tape. <laughs> Just, yeah, just old-fashioned, grab you some seeds and and plant them, yeah. But it, it's beautiful. I mean, they got a good setup here, so. And it goes around to just a regular, then to their heirloom. Uh, a lot of 
springtime stuff starting to happen. So they're putting out a lot of stuff. I don't know if anything's going to be discounted now. Yeah, so it's like 149, 135. Some of the uh, now the ferry most is a little cheaper. So you're looking at uh, the ferry most is coming in at 135, 158 for different things. Uh, we think this year, since we've been so behind, that we're actually going to oh, look another butternut squash I saw, and I picked up one for two something. This one's 158. I think the organic, the organic one is 279, yeah. So I see a change. It's 279. I got to get this butternut squash going. Got to get that going. So that's all we really wanted to share with y'all was, was what's going on, what's new in gardening, stuff that y'all might not have seen, uh, stuff that you may be wondering about. This is some of the stuff that's going on. We got seed tapes. And look, they got this. Let me show y'all something to talk about it uh, seed tape easy to sew tape keeps rows straight and seed depths consistent that's another thing uh, you can get that that seed depth uh, when you make that row that little furry row you can just drop it in and it's going to keep everything level as opposed to some seeds high some seeds low when you drop them with your own hand you kind of you know they're going to kind of go everywhere they want to go even when you start to water them, they start to move. But this seed tape is going to keep it in line. And you can make this seed tape I've seen on YouTube as well. Uh, the seed disc says easy to sew directly in a patio planter or in a garden bed as a centerpiece. Oh, so that's good. Uh, easy pies, I really don't recommend. It just says easy to sew pies contain a combination of seeds, especially, for, uh, especially blended for a perfect harvest. I think the seed disc would be nice. I never thought about that. Not just in a, a container, but like in the middle section of your garden or in your raised bed, it'll be a nice centerpiece to have some flowers growing up out of that seed disc. Uh, so that was cool to have that there. They're kind of showing y'all what they got going out, what's coming in, and how to actually use it. So we're going to let y'all go for today. And thank y'all for watching Louisiana Gardening Family. And it's time to go do the family thing and walk around the store and go home. Peace. And as always, grow, grow, grow.